It is far less frequent today that a natural tooth cannot be saved. But when it happens, the tooth replacement option that gets you back closest to the natural state is a dental implant supported crown. Here we show you how Cirrhic CAD CAM and Galileo's 3D imaging technologies were used to precisely guide a dental implant to where it was best able to support a tooth replacement. The process by which the result was achieved had unquestionable predictability and provided greater ease and comfort for the patient. A middle-aged woman came to us with a dental crown in hand. She said it came off while eating. She hoped her crown could be re-cemented, but was not very optimistic, since her tongue told her that much of her tooth above the gum line was gone. Examination confirmed her suspicions. Decay was severe, making the tooth non-restorable. If the tooth had to be removed, an implant-supported crown, independent of the two adjacent teeth, made sense to our patient. Thus, the decayed molar roots were extracted and their sockets grafted to preserve the bone support for a future dental implant. In about three months, the bone and gums of her lower right were ready to go. Today's CIRAC and Galileo's technology helped us design success for our patient. With the CIRAC Blue Cam system, we imaged and virtually constructed a tooth replacement. We could have created this proposal with physical models of the patient's mouth and a tooth rendered in wax, but Saruna's technology allowed us to do it more cleanly and efficiently on a computer. Then we overlaid the virtual tooth proposal on the Galileo's 3D X-ray image. From there, the exact type, location, and size of implant that best supported the final crown was selected. In this case, we used a dense ply Astra implant. From the virtual planning, we were able to order a surgical template you see here. This clear acrylic stent with the metal ring guides the surgical placement of the dental implant into the exact location, angle and depth we specified by design. There was essentially no wiggle room for error and complication that heretofore was seen with non-guided freehand surgery. Plus, the actual procedure was much easier on the patient than a traditional approach. Here is a photo of the patient's lower right molar site five minutes after the implant was placed. Notice that no stitches were needed. The silver healing button you see helps sculpt the gums above the implant as it transitions to the final crown shape. And this is what the implant looked like on x-ray, perfectly oriented, exactly where it was planned. About three months after surgery, the final post and crown were made in a traditional fashion. A panoramic x-ray confirmed the excellent result that is typical with Cirrhic Galileo's planning and guided implant placement. The crown was in its most optimal position for chewing, and the implant support was predictably aligned directly beneath the crown. Our patient was delighted with her implant support and tooth replacement. She said it looked and felt natural. Besides, she was glad she could brush and floss her implant tooth just like her others. So, if you are faced with a missing tooth or more, and are considering replacement crowns or bridges that require dental implant support, be sure your implants are oriented and delivered accurately and ask for a guided approach that uses today's CIRAC and Galileo's technology to assure your implant restoration is a predictable success.